My name is Jose Alvarez. I teach at New York University School of Law, and this is the second part of my lecture, The Human Right of Property. In the first part of this lecture, I surveyed the many international treaties and other instruments that include protections for property rights, as well as the criticisms on offer for international property rights. In the face of all the critiques of property rights, including critiques of internationalized property rights, what can be said in defense of the property rights treaties and declarations included in my table of 35? Well, the defense of the internationalization of property rights could begin by noting that its origins predate the first treaty on my table, that treaty from 1883. For those in the United States, the idea that property rights are fundamental, inherent to all persons, as a universal truth begins with that country's Declaration of Independence of 1776. 